When you use astrology in your daily life, you're inevitably thinking in terms of archetypes. And thinking in archetypes is kind of like reading Chinese letters or hieroglyphics rather than an alphabet. Like there's more information contained in one symbol with archetypes. The first archetype I want to talk about today is the Jupiter archetype. Jupiter is all about expansion, optimism, and think of it this way. The universe completely has your back. Imagine if that were true. That is true according to Jupiter. That is the message. Saturn, on the other hand, is kind of the opposite. Where Jupiter is expansive, Saturn contracts. Saturn brings things down to Earth. Saturn is what tests the machine before it's offered for sale. Saturn is the test, it's the challenge, it's forcing you to be more grounded. But then, even going beyond Jupiter's expansion, we have Neptune. Neptune looks like a water world. It's a gas world, but in terms of the way it looks to us, it's all blue, like water, and there's no land. Water symbolizes emotion. So Neptune is emotion and beyond. It's intuition. It's tapping into the divine. Neptune can create confusion, excess fantasy, but it also is kind of our portal to the beyond. Pluto is the planet of death and rebirth, death and resurrection. With Pluto, it's all about transformation. It's about how are you changing your life and what needs to die for you to open up the next chapter. 